Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video. And today I will be showing you how to play the Crackers Witherstorm mod on low-end PCs. So right here I have a laptop with a Ryzen 3 3250U uh, with Radeon graphics, which I would consider to be a lower-end device. And it can play Minecraft, but it would definitely need some optic. Oh, sorry, my voice just got this right there. It would definitely need some optimization to play Crackers with the Storm mod. Alright, so let's get started. Alright, so first off, you want to obviously download the mod. So, if you don't know where to download it, just look up Crackers Wither Storm mod in your browser. Alright, once you look up that, just click on the very first thing that comes up. And then, uh, download the version you want. So I downloaded 1.19.4. So you would just click on that, and then it would bring you to here. And then you would just go to the top one, the one at the top. You would click the three dots, and then download file. And it should come up here, and then so you go and you press the Windows key and then R, and it should bring up this. And you click and you type percent app data percent, and then you just press the enter key, and then it should bring up this and um, find the file that says dot Minecraft. Click on that, and then if you don't have Forge installed, go install that. Uh, once you install Forge, it should say mods right there. And this is where you gonna. This is where you will put all of your mods. So, um, just take the Witherstorm file and drag it in here. If it says that it might be a virus, um, it's not a virus. It's completely fine. Uh, just drag it in here. And uh, yeah, and then the next two mods you will need is Rubidium, which is right here. Let's wait for the page to load. This will let um your th this will let your game run very smoothly, and uh, it will optimize uh Minecraft a lot. And Alright, I'm back. Uh, but yeah, Ru Rubidium will optimize your Minecraft, and I will show you how to use it in just a sec. So just download it the same way you did before. Go down here, find the game version you uh, want. So the same one that you downloaded, uh, Crackers with Storm Mod. I used 1.19.4 because that's the newest one. Um, yeah, just go to the top, then download file. It should come up here. If it says anything weird, like keep file or delete file, because it thinks it's a virus, just press keep file, it's fine. And then open your mods folder back up and drag it in here. And then you don't have to download this, I think, but uh, Oculus, remember, go down here and then download this and then drag it into this file. Alright, once you see all these three mods in here, you should be ready to open up Minecraft now. So I will X out all of these tabs. X those out. Alright, let me X out everything. And then you can open the Minecraft launcher. Now make sure you have Forge already uh, installed. I think I, I already said that before, but yeah. So make sure you have Forge already installed. So if you don't know how to uh, uh, download Forge, um, then I guess watch a tutorial how to do that. Because uh, this video isn't on how to install Forge. This is just how to run Crackers with a Storm mod on a lower end PC. Okay, once your Minecraft launcher has finished loading, just um, go to installations and then find your Forge folder. If it doesn't say 1.19.4 or uh, whatever version you uh, were downloading the Crackers with a Storm mod in Oculus and Rubidium for, um, just make make sure it's the right version. 
and then you can just uh, click play and then I will show you how to fully optimize your Minecraft when it loads so you can play crackers with your store mod alright once you have Minecraft loaded up um, go to options and then video settings and then in general you want to set your render distance to 4 or lower so oh yeah and this uh, menu might look a little different but um it has some really good optimiz optimiz what am I saying optimizations that you can use so yeah uh, chunks 4 or lower um max shadow distance um this uh you should set to like I say like five actually set it to like four. Yeah. And then this um set it all the way down. Brightness just I don't think brightness really controls like the performance Joe. You don't have to change that. Um and then V Sync I'll just keep I'll just uh keep this at V Sync. I'll turn on V Sync for the <coughs> for the I'll just keep on V Sync for the purposes of this video. Yeah. Chunk update set this to zero. Turn all of these on. These will give you a lot a lot more FPS. Advanced turn async. Turn on async, um, this one, turn it on, um, this one, you don't have to change anything, and then this one, turn it on. Alright, shader packs, just don't turn on any shader packs, and, alright, you can click apply, and then click done. Alright, now, let me go into a world where I have spawn the wither storm and we'll see how this performs okay now that you're in your world um you can see that i'm getting <clears throat> around 20 30 fps um which really isn't that bad and okay. sometimes you will get more like see i was getting 44 fps there like, it, it really, like, fluctuates a lot, like, how much FPS you'll get and such. Um, as the world loads in, you'll start getting more FPS. And, uh, make sure that you're, uh, if you have a laptop, make sure it's plugged in. Alright, we're getting near the wither storm. And, looks like we're getting about the same frames per second, about, like, 30, 20. In the teens, 20s. A few hiccups here and there, but I mean, I would say it's playable. And here's the weather storm. Yeah, I would say that this mod is playable if you optimize it. I'm not sure how you would be able to see if the hole has formed or not like in the last stages so you might have to turn up the render distance for that so yeah the wither storm mod is playable on low end devices if you have rubidium and oculus so yeah okay guys thank you so much for watching this video please like comment and subscribe for more videos like this and yeah, I hope you guys have fun playing crackers with a storm on your computer. Have a nice day. Bye.